What is up, Holly Springs Color Guard? Aaliyah here. I am going to be showing you guys how you're going to be doing your makeup for this season. Yay! Um, this video is going to be a little bit different compared to the videos that I've done in the past where I'm going to be doing a voiceover instead of talking while doing the makeup. So for your makeup this season, I'm not sure if Lucas shown you guys the costumes just yet, but all I know is that you're going to be in different, everybody's going to be in different colors almost, and your colors are either going to be yellow, pink, blue, green or purple yeah yellow yellow pink blue green or purple so how I'm basically going to be doing this tutorial is is I'm picking one color from one of the costume from one of the costume colors and that's how I'm going to be doing the tutorial but whatever color you are given for your costume that is the color you need to use whenever you're doing your makeup so for this tutorial I'm going to be doing yellow just because I feel like yellow might be a little bit more difficult to do um and that might be the one that needs to be shown like how to properly do more so especially if you are going to be given yellow and you have more of a deeper complexion like me um so i'm going to be doing this tutorial using yellow but again with whatever color you are given whether it's the yellow or pink green blue or purple one of the other colors you're going to be following this tutorial as well but you're going to be doing your color cool all right Let's go ahead and get into this video. Hey guys, so I did one eye off camera and I'm gonna show you guys how to do the other eye now. So first you're gonna start off with a eyeshadow primer. If you're a little bit more darker or tan like me, you're gonna wanna get an eyeshadow primer that's slightly lighter than your skin tone so that way the eyeshadows appear more vibrant and then just blend it out all over your lid and then set it down with a um, neutral color or skin color eyeshadow or some setting powder. Next, you're gonna take the eyeshadow that is most like your uniform color on a fluffy blending brush and pack it into your crease and then slowly start to blend it out until it looks very opaque in your crease. And then you're also gonna kind of do like a little winged out motion with it like I did, like I do later on. Those of you in the other uniform colors might not need to do this as much just because your colors are a little bit more opaque and vibrant versus yellow. So it might not take it as much, but yellow, you're gonna need to do this quite a little bit. Next, you're gonna take a brush that's kind of flat but also still kind of fluffy and take that same eyeshadow and just pack it all over your lid and also blend it up into the crease. This is just gonna help make sure that everything is nice and blended and even all over your eyelid and also to make sure that your eyeshadow looks very opaque and seamlessly blended. Next, you're gonna take a shimmer shade that is either the exact same color as the crease shade or slightly lighter on a flat brush and you're going to pack that all over your lid and kind of swoop it across your lid and notice kind of the way I'm doing it almost doing is if I'm doing kind of a cut crease so I'm taking it up into my crease a little bit if you want your shimmer shades to be a little bit more vibrant you can spray your flat brush with some setting spray or you can use your finger like how I just did and you're also going to want to wing out your shimmer shadow just a tad bit and then you're going to take your fluffy blending brush with your crease shade and go back into your crease and blend everything out just to make sure it's slightly seamless and if you lose any of that shimmer shadow you can go back in and pack a little bit of it back on after you're done blending like how i'm doing now after everything is nice and blended you're going to go on ahead and throw on some liner it can be a nice thin simple wing it does not have to be too dramatic and then you can follow up with some mascara and here's what the eye look looks like so far you're almost done you can go ahead and clean it up a little bit it'll probably be cleaned up once you do your foundation if you do that or your concealer then you're going to go ahead and take a eyeliner pencil that's about the same color as your eyelid color and run that along your waterline and then just take a little bit of that shimmer shadow that you used before and blend out your under eye after that you can go ahead and throw on a nice natural colored blush and some highlighter for the people that are in the yellow I would say go ahead and get like a golden or champagne-ish looking highlighter if you're in pink and purple I would say go for like a pinkish or golden highlighter and then if you are in the blue and green I would say go for like a champagne or maybe even a slightly silver highlighter but you don't want to be too silver and you can pop that on your face in your inner corner and on your nose and when you're done with that you're gonna go ahead and throw on your lips in this video I did a more your lips but better nude type color but we actually are gonna want you guys to wear a more reddish or berryish type of lip color and I'll show you guys a image of what that will look like um, later on in the video and post it on the Google classroom but this is your makeup 
All right, guys, so that about wraps it up for your little to toot for your makeup for the season. And again, like I said at the beginning of the video, this tutorial is for everybody to use. I just used the yellow people's costume color as the example for this tutorial. So whenever you're following this tutorial, remember you are following this tutorial, but you're using your color for your costume, whatever you get selected for whatever color you are. And um, I think I probably already mentioned this in the video. So for whatever color that you use, use a light color or something like that, or basically like that exact same color as your costume for your actual eyeshadow for your crease color and for the color that goes all over your lid and then use a shimmer version of that color for your actual eyelid like I did with the yellow. So like in the tutorial how I use like this yellowish gold looking color is basically almost yellow. That's basically what you want to do. So for like the pink people I would recommend using a color that's about this shade of pink for pink and this shade for the shimmer and then I would say for the blue people maybe using this maybe using like a royal blue and then using like this shade of blue for using like two colors like this for your makeup so just this for the um for the crease and all over lid color and then this for the um shimmer color and then for green i would say using like a light green like this that i have my nails pointing to and then a green that's about like this shade or maybe even this shade for your green eyeshadow and then for purple you guys are fairly simple because you guys are kind of look you guys are kind of like almost like grape soda so I would say maybe like this color this grape looking this grape purple looking color for your sh for your um eyeshadow and then possibly even doing this light color or doing a color that's like this as the lid colors if you guys need any help with any of your makeup please feel free to reach out to me i do not mind if you do that because i want to make sure that you guys look great this season not just on the field like doing your dance work and doing your flag work and all what all the work that you guys are going to be doing for your show but also for your makeup as well because i don't want y'all looking crazy out there on the field and i think i will also try to find either makeup that's either if not this exact same stuff that i use in the video or try to link stuff that's similar and post it to the google classroom as well so that way you guys can have those to do your makeup with and as i said before that about wraps it up <laughs> make sure you like and subscribe i'm just kidding but um again make sure you reach out to me if you have any questions and good luck see y'all later